Hello everyone, this is Omega45, and today I'm going to show you what dug this giant hole. It is right behind me. It is my giant frame quarry. So, I have been watching a lot of the PyGraph server, and again, I got the idea for this. Um, I think I made some improvements on it uh, from the ones I saw. So, here it is. Uh, up here is the cutting head. It is just block breakers with redstone tubes and frames. Goes all the way up here. It's really dark. Um, and let's see if it's right here. So, no, can't. All right. Um, so let's just move back and forth, and we'll cut the uh, wall in front of it. This is a giant uh, lava hood. It will keep lava from. Uh, from falling on the mechanical components down here. Um, so this will move forward and the lava will just slide off like it did over here. That's why it's flat up here. Over here I have some torch placers that are just running off a two minute timer right here. So fun stuff. Anchor cart. Yes, diamond blocks because I didn't have any other blocks on me at the time. Um, here's my engine, my uh, caterpillar engine, and this is all fed from a surface battery recharger. So, batteries go to the ender chests and get pulled out through these retrievers right there, and there's one over here, there. Then they'll get put into bat boxes. And then this one feeds these two frame motors, which pushes the head back and forth. And then this one is the engine that moves it forward. Um, so I have five ender chests on this trigger lag, because uh, this pulls in so many resources so quickly that I thought it would just be better. Um, so it's not all just filtered one central point. They'll have sort of their own chests to go to. Uh, and that's about it. Here, I'll, uh, I'll show you how it works. I'll go 10, whoops, that's a zero. 10 times full. So as you can see, there it goes. Let me grab my ender pouch. This goes up to my sorting system in my main base. And there you go. So this is how fast this thing is going, and it is just, it is insane. Once you build one of these, you'll never have to worry about resources again. It's really that, it's it's that reliable and that fast. So, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, here, I uh, will show you the battery recharging facility. Here it is. So this is all it is. It's really, really simple. Um, filter, pulling out dead batteries. Goes into the two bat boxes. The getting a lot of lag spikes. The retriever pulls out full batteries and pushes them in there. And that's it. That's how this works. It's really that simple. And this just pulses the two. Uh, uh, the filter in the retriever. So yeah, if you guys have any questions, uh, don't be afraid to leave a comment or a message me, and I'll see you later. Bye.